Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh. Alhamdulillah rabbil alamin hamdan katsiran thayyiban mubarakan fihi. Allahumma salli wa sallim wa barik ala sayyidina Muhammad wa ala alihi wa sahbihi wa sallim amma ba'du. Oh bas. Lo ana mesti fahim bari bas basalah mesti. Ikhwati wa akhawati fillah my brothers and sister in Islam. I will try to speak in English. Uh, as I can as possible uh, I want to deliver two message for uh, to advise myself and my brother as well the first message is Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala said in Al-Quran Ya ayuhal ladhina amanu kutiba alaykum usiyam كما كتب على الذين من قبلكم لعلكم تتقون. Oh, you will believe. Fasting has uh, was prescribed for you as it was prescribed for those before you. So you perhaps become muttaqin. Someone asked me, Sheikh. If we perform fasting all day of Ramadan, after Ramadan we automatically become muttaqin or not? I say no, not automatically because Allah say, perhaps may you become muttaqin. What is the root of uh, word of taqwa in in the Arabic? Taqwa is come from waqa yaqi wiqayatan. Is it right? Waqa yaqi wiqayatan. What's mean wiqaya? Wiqaya is to take the protection from something that harmful for you. If you see the fire in front of you, so you take the barrier. That's when you protect yourself from something that's harmful for you from the fire. So, from taqwa, we learn from siyam or fasting we learn how to prevent how to protect ourselves from punishment of Allah from the punishment of Allah we learn from that so the the the, the mindset or the mindset of muttaqin is how to protect himself from something harmful and could Allah punish him? Let me take you uh, for an example. When we drive our car on the road or on the street, he says, right? The road. Yes, on the road, yeah. <coughs> the same? Yeah. If you know in front of you so many obstacles, so if you push your pedal so many, so you are not mutakin. The muttaqin is when you know so many obstacles in front of you, so you will push so many the pedal of brake. Even you will come late to your work. It is better for me to be safety on my way. Even I will come late. The mindset of muttaqin protect himself from something hurtful. That is taqwa that we learn from the siyam, from Ramadan, protect ourselves. So after Ramadan, when we learn so many lessons from the siyam, inshallah maybe we can, uh, we have ability or capability to be muttaqin for next year inshallah ta'ala. That is what the first message I want to say for me to advise, my, to advise myself and my brothers as well. The second message is Siam, from Siam we learn together that Allah has created us completely perfect and we believe of that because Allah Say in the Al Quran, "Lakad khalaqna al-insana fi ahsani taqwim." 
Hey? If I say something in the Quran, mistake man by my brother man. Okay. Because if you don't understand what I say, my brother will correct me. Yeah, because I'm learning here. Yeah? So after that, second, Allah said in the Quran is Lakar Khalakna Insana fi Ahsani Takwin that we had created we, 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 we have created uh, the man in perfect perfectly creation. Oh, yeah. So someone asked, but we have shahwah, we have lust of shahwah nafs. How we say shahwah nafs? Desire, desire yes. Allah installed within us desire. We tend to think that desire that Allah installed within us, there is something negative. The the uh, the root of pro of problem in our life. But this is misunderstanding. Allah has, has uh, installed within us shahwa is to be benefit in our life. That's. Uh, to be useful, the continuation of the human being. The continuation of human being to continue our life in a very good life. So, see, in Al in uh, Suyam, we learn how because the problem is of of desire is how to control our desire. Not I has desire. I have desire. Allah has installed within us all. So now we have to control our desire and this we learn from the Suya. Let me take you an example. We has uh, all we have our cars. Uh, our car when we put in our car gasoline, you know, yes. gasoline. Yes. If you put your uh, Ga uh, gasoline in the place that speci specialized in the tank of gasoline so after that you lock it completely so you can burn it so after that your engine of your car will work then benefit and useful for you bring you everywhere because gasoline you put it completely in its place so now imagine, if you have gasoline, so you put it outside and you burn it, what will happen? You can destroy everything. That is shahwa and desire. If you don't control it in its specialist place, at a specialized place, you can destroy yourself and destroy others. So that is we learn what we learn from the Suyam, how to control our desire. All day of Ramadan. It is beautiful Ramadan here. May Allah accept from us. Amen. And may Allah accept a taqwa. Amen. And may Allah accept al qiyam wa suyam. Ruku'ana wa sujoonana. Wa taqabal Allah min awamikum salih al-amal. Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh.